Hey, happy new year guys from the Backridge Butcher Clan. <laughs> Here we are for our first adventure of 2019. We've grabbed Johnny Morris, yeah. he's coming along with us. He's roped in. <laughs> he's looking forward to it. Uh, so we're flying in with Criss Cross here at Pukatitri and we're going to go into Naparua and we're going to be rafting down the Naruroro. So we're looking forward to it. It's hot as in the bay, so this is going to be just primo. Yeah. Well that was a really cool flight in with Chris and we're here at Naparu. Now it's time to drag our, our mountain of gear down to the river, get these rafts pumped up and uh, hit the rapids. Well guys we've made Omar Biv, our first time for me here, it's quite cool, so it's your classic old uh, Kawika Bibby and then they've built a shelter on the front of it which would be really good in the storm, you can stand up, you can cook in it, hang all your wet gear. Um, I can see Spion Cop to the south here up on the tops, it looks awesome. So we're probably 3k's to go down the river to rocks ahead where we hope to sleep tonight so um, I've got a confession to make I've completely stuffed up the team might mutiny for this one but I've left our big barrel at home and it's got all our food in it three days of supplies we have lots of goodies so we managed to find some cans of baked beans at Harkness so whoever left those there thanks guys so what's happening so far well, it looks like we're going to get skinny on this trip. The majority of the food is back at home base. Uh, we have got a smoke stick though, so if we really get desperate, I reckon the boy over there is looking mighty tasty. <laughs> oh, make a ten.
Good on you. So morning guys, pretty good night here at Rocks Ahead last night, a couple of laughs with the troops, um, there's been a few trampers passing through which is good to see people out in the park and uh, we're just going to re-pump the rafts up, pack up and yeah, get back on the water which is going to be really cool. It's looking like another stunning day here in the car wickers, so. from Kiwi Mouth, about three quarters of the way up to the Manson, and I've just spotted a deer, oh, she's probably seven, eight hundred yards across a big, big gully. Really cool to see one, I'm desperate to see one tonight. Um, I've been trying to think whether I can put a stalk on her, but realistically it's probably too tough. The wind is the big killer tonight, it's just howling. It's a bastard actually. In this position I'm in here that it keeps blowing over the top and just blowing through almost little mini dust storms. It's horrible. That was a pretty cool walk. Kind of needed it after a couple of days on the river in the raft. I wanted to stretch the legs, keep the fitness going. Um, got man's gone up towards back ridge so interesting to see how he's got on. I'm guessing he's found it really tough like I did because man that wind was just howling tonight but anyway it is what it is. Um, back to camp, catch up with Emma and Jonty and hopefully have some smoked chorizos that I made the other day and, and the back steaks off a couple of fat little Jap stags that I got with Dangerous Dave just after Christmas. What's the plan this morning, got man? Uh, well, plan A is to get everybody down safely out to Kripaponga. Plan B would be to shoot a silly deer, but that's not highly likely. <laughs> plan C is just have fun. Doing full? Just running the block. Good. So that's our short stay at uh, Kiwi Mouth. Now it's back down to the river, get these rafts yeah. pumped up and uh, head down to Cameron. Check that out, a couple of hours away and then a couple of hours down to Kiri. Now pick up and Keith promises us cold beer.
<laughs> yeah, yeah, bring the knife. <laughs> get my pack, get my pack. Oh, you like we're doing a video. <laughs> So masses of action, um, it was like the gunfight of the Alamo. Like a Mexican standoff. Poor old young seeker stag, he's bit in the dust, but he's getting a free ride down the river, something he never thought he'd get. We've just um, made Cameron Hut. Kept been here for years and years. It's got that nice smoky smell about it. Again, the open fire. It's a pretty cool, cool spot. I think last time Emma and I were here, we'd walk down the river. There was a swing bridge in those days. You could get across, and all around the outside of the hut was just pig rooting for Africa. It was a long, long time ago. Anyway, we'll push on, get back in the raft, and I think we might have about an hour and a half down the river to um, to our pickup and cold beer. Well, guys, what an awesome way to end the trip. We managed to achieve all of Keith's requirements, which was A, B, and C. A, everyone get down the river safely. B Let's score a deer. Well done, Keith. And C, everyone had a ball. Hey, big shout out to Colin and Vicky Palmer. Thank you very much for lending us your awesome raft.